Okay, yo. Guys, I'm so annoyed. So, I rent books and I, like, for school, I think I told you that before in another vlog, but get this. I, like, just finished school and apparently my books were due, like, a week ago or something and I'm like, I just finished school. Like, how are they possibly late now? So, I'm going to the UPS place to send these boxes which are my books back and I also have to get gas because I only have like 66 miles and when like in winter when it's really cold you don't want to have like a, not a lot of gas because that's like not good for your car or something I don't know that's just what I've been told by people so yeah okay so I'm gonna go do all those things and I'm gonna hate getting gas. Oh my God, it's so cold, but yeah. Okay, let's go. Guys, I just waved at someone and they didn't wave back. I'm kind of upset about it, so yeah. Okay, so I'm at the UPS store. Um, oh my gosh, I'm vlogging and someone just like parked right next to me and he probably thinks I'm so silly, but he's dropping off a UPS package just like I am and clearly doesn't give a crap about what I'm doing and I'm just being insecure for no reason, okay? <laughs> but I always get really nervous. I have to find my keys, so I'm gonna just talk to you while I'm finding them. Um, I always get really nervous when I'm doing something for the first time. Like I've never sent anything out to UP like through UPS before by myself. And like, it wasn't bad. Like it wasn't bad, but I got all nervous. Like she, like I walked in with two packages and obviously she knew what I wanted, which was to ship them out. Like, no, I just want to hold them and stand there. Like, that's what I want to do. No, like she knew what I wanted. Like, I get so nervous. Does anyone else get that nervous when they like, have never done something before? It's like, I don't know. I just like, I'm a worrier. Okay, that's all. I'm gonna go get gas now. Pray for me, it's so cold outside. Okay, bye, I'll be back. Uh, guys, so I just, what is this guy doing? Oh, I hate when people suck at driving. So I just drove all the way home and then realized that I didn't stop and get gas. So that is just really funny. Dang it. I was too busy jamming. I was singing Legally Blonde, you know? Capella, and I got too carried away that I wasn't paying attention to where I was going and I just drove myself home so good thing the gas station isn't too far from my house but obviously it would have been nicer if I had gone there in the first place but I did not it's fine you know maybe that happened for a reason that's what I'd like to believe okay I'm at a red light so I'm gonna pick up my camera now I only do these sort of things when I'm at like, red lights because otherwise that's really dangerous okay bye I'm gonna get gas if you hadn't caught on to what's going on now. So, just a quick question. But have any of you almost accidentally filled your car up with diesel? Because same. No, like literally, like usually the gas stations that I go to only have like one like pump thingy that you put in your car, but this one had two and I just like grabbed the first one that I saw and apparently that one only does diesel. So I had to cancel everything and it was just like, oh, I was like freaking out, but it didn't charge my card or anything, thank goodness. But yes, I did also sanitize before I like came back in my car. I have this lavender organic hand sanitizer and you just like spray it and it's really convenient. It looks like this smells real good. Is it gonna focus? Is it gonna focus? Okay, I guess it doesn't really matter because you're probably not gonna find the same one. I think they have it on Amazon though. But yeah, I'm gonna go home. Also, it's freezing and of course that mishap happened when it's like freaking cold and my hands are so cold. Do you see how cold? They're so cold. I mean, you can't really tell, but I can tell. So quick PSA, Kohl's has like the softest cardigans right now. So my mom got this brown one and I got this like cream one. It's my Christmas present though, so don't, don't tell anyone. It's like my mom's Christmas present to me, okay. <laughs> okay guys, so as you, oh sorry, this is not in focus. Hello, is it gonna focus? Yeah, I did it. Okay, so as you saw, I was at Bath and Body Works and y'all, this is the best candle ever it's frosted cranberry and it's seasonal so they only have it during christmas as you can see like look how cute that decoration is but 
it smells so good please go buy it and stock up because they obviously oh my god i just said obviously so weird hello is it gonna is it gonna light um i'm freaking out so they obviously only have this candle during um winter like christmas season so wait what is going on with this are you are you guys seeing this like it's really taking a long time to get it to light there we go who texted me i like never get text messages oh my gosh it's rachel hey girl oh my god wait you watch my vlogs hi okay <laughs> Hey guys, so it's later in the day and I'm actually gonna be going to Pike's house in a bit. He's my friend from high school. I am like going into college, but like we don't go to the same college. Um, and I'm so excited. We are gonna watch the Ariana Grande, excuse me, I love you documentary series on Netflix. Oh, I'm so excited. Pike and I have gone to, I think it's two Ariana Grande concerts together. Yeah, it's two, not three. It's two. Oh, and I love him. I'm so excited to see him and to jam out to Ari and to like see all the behind the scenes footage and stuff. Um, what time is it? I'm not going for a while though. It's um 4.33 right now and I have to be at his house at 6.30 and I have to leave around 6-ish for that. So I have a little bit, so I'm gonna make some food and stuff. But I thought I would tell you because I didn't think that I'd tell you that that's what's going on, but I'm so excited. Oh my gosh. Um, Earlier... Sorry, that was weird. Okay. Earlier today, I wrapped some presents for my dog, Lacey Lou. Hi, Lou. Um, and for George Blake's dog. There's like four of them here. Oh, are you looking at me? She's like, I'm hungry. Mom's not home. Mom, my mom's gonna feed her when she gets home. But yeah, I did that today too. So I have just a little bit left of Josh's soup that I made the other day. Like we made it together before, but this batch I made by myself. First time it went really well. Um, here look, there's not that much at all. I have to make more of the broth that goes with it because the noodles kind of like soaks it up, but I'm so excited to eat the rest of this. Um, I'll probably make another batch soon, but not for a while since I've had it like a lot. But also this pot is really cool. I highly suggest getting a copper pan or just copper like pots because it helps with cleaning like usually this would be really hard to clean off but it's not because there's like cheese and stuff but just a little life hack if you don't want to make your life really hard when it comes to cleaning pots also i think in one of my other vlogs i said that i would show you what our lights look like on and i never did that so we have lights lined all around outside on our deck and it looks so pretty i already showed you our tree but some updates, this top part burnt out and this middle section burnt out. So that really stinks. I think there's also a lower section. Uh, maybe not, but yeah, that kind of stinks. But isn't it so pretty? I love it's like all like, I don't know, crystal-y, snowflake-y. I love it. It's so cute. Ari! <laughs> yeah. Grab your mic. Wait, you need to, can you turn your flashlight on <laughs> so I can see? Okay, Ari. Ari, slow down. Ari, slow down. We're trying to sing with you. He's not ready. Okay. No, no, no. <laughs> you tell me every time. Oh, shit. Still love moment. Ari, right, here you go, girl. Oh, shit. It's her. Oh, wait. Does she want. Wait. Oh, shit. Oh, it's our turn. Oh, that, it's your turn now. <laughs> be there. Be there. Be there. Be there. I know. Here you go. Ooh, yeah. yeah. <laughs> we love her. We do. Oh, <laughs> you notice I got the tea. I got the tea for the tea. <laughs> for the tea. <laughs> Wait, if, you, if you want to party. Oh shit. <laughs> love, love that. <laughs> I'm hugging it out. Go from twerk to a hug. <laughs> this is so right. I just hit my head on your wall. <laughs> not the painting. I'm not as a picture. Oh yeah, please. I like the haircut. Mm -hmm. Oh, that choreo. See, I didn't even notice that. I was just watching her. I know. <laughs> there the, there Oh damn, she's going at him. What were they doing behind the stage? Jeez Louise, Ari. <laughs> oh, that poor man. Oh, I love that dance. Oh, I know. Dude, that was like a dad. I know, that was a dad. <laughs> I like that guitar. Oh damn. Oh, yes. That was good. Wow. <laughs> that background oh. is so cool. Hey, 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 hey. hey. The high note. That high note. <laughs> <laughs> I like that attitude from the dancers. Oh, they, they read up. They just told a whole story. Yeah, they did. Wow. That was so good. So Pike is showing me Ariana Grande's Vogue, like waking up with me. And he didn't know that this is like her Ariana Grande's face over Emma Chamberlain. Like this isn't actually Ariana Grande. <laughs> That's Emma Chamberlain, but they just like put Ariana Grande 
Grande's face over it. Okay, so let's find her real thing then. <laughs> why would someone make that? That's so weird. Like, why would someone, mm, like, you want to type in Vogue? Yeah, you right. There you go. Yeah. Thinking. No, like, I'm surprised that someone made that. Like, who would be like, I'm going to put Ariana Grande's face over Emma Chamberlain's body? Does she? Oh, it's that one. Oh, is it the British Vogue? Yeah. Okay, say. Her in a tub. Like makes that, more sense. Makes more sense. And the bubble bath, you know, like, <laughs> ah, the Yeah. What the hell is this? Oh, I use that actually. Not that. <laughs> <laughs> no, not like that, but I use that brand, Cerave. Uh -huh. Yeah, it's good. <laughs> Exciting times. Uh -uh. Hey, yeah, see, this is more legit. Yeah, this makes <laughs> a lot more sense. <laughs> <laughs> I think that you have to just listen to what's inside instead. So, we're going to give you our review yes. of. The sweetener, or what is it? Excuse me, the, I love excuse you. Me, I love you, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> exactly. I like just watched the whole thing. And I know what it's called. So I thought it was good. I wish they showed a little bit more of behind the scenes stuff, to be honest. Same. I mean, like, I know it was like to see the show, but like, I like seeing more like behind the scenes. Because, like, I yeah. saw the show, like, not trying to flex, but. It would be cool if it was like more of Ari talking yeah. than singing. Yeah. Because true, we did see the show. Right. I, it was cool because the thing is, is when you see the show live, you're only watching Ariana Grande, so you miss a lot. So like the choreography. Yeah, we appreciate it. It was like it seeing it Loki for the first time. Yeah. Some of the like lights was like seeing it for the first time because you're like, you missed it. You know what I mean? I also like all the fan stuff. I know, yeah, that was really See, good. See, the fans was kind of funny. So that was our review. So watch it, support the queen. It was amazing. It was really good. Really there was really a good. lot of bops. Lots of bops. Lots of bops. <laughs> Bye. Bye. <laughs>